producing biogas in biogas generators by kscience.com. This here is a microorganism, and it's the anaerobic respiration in microorganisms from decay of dead biological matter that produces the biogas called methane. So methane is the byproduct of anaerobic respiration in microorganisms. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. So what's the difference between a batch generator and a continuous generator? Both of them are going to produce biogas. But what's the difference between the two? This here is a batch generator. It produces biogas in batches. This is because it can process biological waste in batches. So you've got batch one, batch two, batch three, and batch four. So the batch generator is filled with the biological waste from batch one. And the anaerobic respiration by microorganisms will cause methane to be released as a byproduct. This means that the methane can be collected through one of the outlet pipes. So waste is put into the inlet pipe and there are two outlet pipes, one for the methane that is collected and one for the decayed biological matter that is no longer needed. Because this is a batch generator and waste is put into the generator in batches, the decayed waste is cleared away after each batch and so is the methane. So as you can see here, the decayed waste is cleared away after each batch. This represents the second batch now filling up the empty batch generator. And the second batch of methane is going to be collected. And then there's going to be a second batch of decayed waste that will be cleared away. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. This here is a continuous generator. It's often much larger than a batch generator and used for much bigger projects where biogas is produced on a larger scale. This is a large waste storage unit for a lot of biological waste. The biological waste is continuously fed into the continuous generator. That means biogas is produced at a steady rate. So waste is continuously fed into the generator. So waste is continuously fed into the generator, which means biogas is produced at a steady rate. Compared to a batch generator, where biogas is not produced at a steady rate, it's only produced when the waste batches are in the generator. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes.